your Sunday. A quick check of what's going on in the tropics here. We're continuing to monitor two tropical waves. The first one here out in the deep Atlantic here in the eastern Atlantic. It started to take shape, has a low chance of tropical development as we go through the next two to five days. But we're going to continue to focus on this tropical wave here. Again, it doesn't look like much right now. The wind shear is rather weak, but it is surrounded by dry air. So slow development is likely as we go through the rest of the weekend heading into midweek. So we'll continue to watch that very closely and long range models. Again, not an agreement. Some models are taking that area of moisture into the Gulf of Mexico. Others are taking it into Central America. Keep in mind, after five days, models are really just not that reliable. So again, there's an update there. And just to note, it's been 54 days since we've had or tracked a named storm. Our last named storm was Tropical Storm Colin, which I just mentioned, and that was back in the beginning of July and the record 61 days set back in 1999. So we might break that. Of course, we'll have to watch that and see what happens. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. So the weekend upper 80 scattered showers and thunderstorms are possible as we go through the rest of the work week here. Notice the rain chances will continue to bump down slightly but our temperatures will bump up into the lower 90s Tuesday and Wednesday. All right.